What's up YouTube, I'm Jack and this is Jack Reacts and today y'all we have a real, real special video, definitely. Today we have Michael Jackson, Wanna Be Starting Something and this is off the Thriller album. That's what makes this particularly special to me. Of course, it's Michael. Every song I do from him is going to be special, but something about the Thriller album, I I, I don't know. I, I love reacting to it. It's very nostalgic for me too because my mom used to play some of the songs off that when I was little. And speaking of, this is one of those Michael songs that I've heard before and I do this because it's one of those things like I heard on the radio when I was a little kid or something like that but I can promise you that I've not heard this whole six minute song so that's what I'm going to be doing today reacting to the entire song in its totality really listening to the lyrics the sounds all of it so yeah without further ado I got the lyrics pulled up let me know what I missed in the comments below and let's go ahead and get right into it Baseline is nasty. I remember that. <clears throat> Yeah, man, if this don't make you want to dance, you're dead inside. I'm sorry. That's the only part I know. <laughs> All right, let me go to pause right here. I do need to talk about this just a little bit. I'll make it brief and we will get right back into it. But already, I am loving it so much. I mean, I knew I was gonna love it again. I heard it when I was a little, little kid, but it's been so, so long. I don't know what it was with this project. It just seems like everything was perfect. And you could argue the same thing with Off The Wall and The Bad Album and Invincible. Don't get me wrong. This is just on another level for me personally. Anyways, as far as like lyrics goes and all that, I don't really want to break all that down. I mean, there were some good lyrics, but this is just a fun song. It's something that I really want to dance along to, groove along to. So in other words, I'm not going to read too deep into this. I'm just going to have a fun time. So on that note, let's get back to it. I love that, that's his famous ad lib right there. The hee hee part. <laughs> mm. And I can't tell if that's a choir doing the, the yeah yeah part or if that's just his voice layered. Let me know. Yo, what? <laughs> He said vegetable, I think. <laughs> I like the way he sings his verses. Like right there. It's like an affectation, I like it. <laughs> I want some rollerblades. I can't even rollerblade, but this seemed like a good song to skate to. Yeah, he definitely said vegetable. I love that. I don't know what that means.
Oh, we got a little breakdown? Okay. Y'all know I love a good breakdown. Mmm. That's funky. Ooh, that was smooth. I don't know what that was, too. All this is just so smooth. Again, this album is perfect. Actually, real, real quick, real quick, before we get back into it, I just wanted to say something because this was on my mind. So, uh, of course, what I'm reacting to right here is the audio. It's not a music video. I think most songs I react to from Michael are music videos or live performances. They usually have a visual is what I'm trying to say. But what's interesting about this, as much as I know a video would be so good to this and I would love to watch a music video to this song, I just feel like this is so lively. It has so much energy to it. You really don't even need a visual because it's almost like it happens in your head, if that makes sense. I was just saying a minute ago, like, man, I, I could really have some, some roller skates. I, I could picture myself being in like a, a disco with lights going crazy. It, it, it's almost like it happens in your head. The, the music, it brings that out of you. So I just want to say that because that's very special to me when music can evoke certain things out of you. Um, anyways, let's get back to it. <laughs> He's saying it now. So I know that. I did not know that was this song. That's that's fire. I love that. Wow. I'm like mind blown right now. Ooh. <laughs> I got the beat drop right. I feel like a part of my childhood was just unearthed. I had no idea that that was this song. Again, of course, I think everyone knows Mama Say, Mama Say, Mama Kusa. That's like his thing. Um, I did not know that was his song though. Wow, I'm so, so happy I reacted to this. Thank you. Thank you to all y'all who recommended this to me. Again, like I said earlier, I heard this song before, and this is why I love going back and reacting to some of these songs that I may or may not have heard in my childhood, or you know, I heard bits and pieces on the radio, because of moments like this, like, oh, I didn't know that was in this song, or I, I heard that before, I didn't know that that was by this artist, or whatever the case. It, it, it just makes it that much more special, and it makes me appreciate the song that much more. Uh, of course, I said not to say this, this is going on the playlist now. Now, and I'm gonna be listening to this for the first time in you know however many years. It's just beautiful. It's like my whole life has come full circle. Thank you, thank you once again. Uh, anyways, that is it for the video. If y'all liked it, please make sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications if you haven't already. And y'all have a blessed day, blessed night, whatever part of the world you're watching this in. And peace.